Hello everyone, welcome back to uh, The Walking Dead. Um, you know, I've just been playing Resident Evil 1, right, recording it for the channel. And now, uh, my perception, you know, I can't, trying to control this character is all fucked up. What's up, Glenn? I know you, you for a TV show. Yeah, although you look happier in the TV show, you're kind of grumpy right there. Uh, let's talk to Douglas. What's up, Doug? Doug, how are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Yes, I do. Let's have a look around. Let's have okay. a look around. Right, so apparently I gotta point out this guy again. Ah, there's a photo. That guy Thanks there. for the comment, Jesus. whoever left that. How can you be sure? Got the picture. Look. Found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. I can't reach that brick. Dang it. Can Doug, can you get a brick? Those things like TV. Mm. At least the sound of it. If they were louder, we might be able to clear the street. They were louder. How are we gonna... Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I know what it is. Most of who you see wandering around out there. We need a remote control for this. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. But right, we need to break the glass. So can you just pass me that fucking brick, dude? Can't reach that brick. He can, cause he's in the way. Jeez Louise, man. Fuck. Can I select? All right, let's go back inside, you douchebag. Let's head back inside. Okay. God, just get the brick, fucker. I get angry. Okay, Doug, you dick. What can we use to get the brick? Is there any sprint button? This game I forgot. Reading cards. What are they gonna do? No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead gods. Indeed. Try to get some rest, hun. How can I with those things out there? How are we doing? What if Doug can... Okay. Better get back to getting this guy's medicine. Hmm. Take your time. Come on, you don't hate him that much, Kenny. There's an energy... fucking chocolate there. Life inside. That bitch, Lily. How's it doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again, and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad. That didn't help. Well, he's a mouthy bastard. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. He's got a temper. Ah, oh, fuck you! Whoa, dude! Yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Oh, he does. Yeah? We got kids here, families, never mind. I'm sure he's a good guy. Never mind. I'm sure he's a good guy. He is. He just has his issues. <clears throat> like a big fucking nose. Where's her mom? Savannah, I think. Oh. You guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answer. I was already going to say. They were 
at Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. What do you think about all this? Dang it. What is there to think? The dead are up walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Yeah, bitch. Okay, well, I need something to get at the brick. I mean, like, the, he could just open the fucking gate for a second, and then I could get the fucking brick. You know? Clemmy, why you keep following me in here? I mean, the fucking... came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of the most hurt I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. First aid kit. Oh, here we go. <laughs> bonka, bonka. Come on, you can do it. Keys it is, I guess. Okay. I oh, man. Yeah, this, there's like seriously nothing. First aid kit. Oh, remote control. That's what I figured. So I've got remote control, right? How do I even select it though? I mean, I'm sure Doug could. I think I remember him saying he could reprogram it because it's universal. Doug, 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 Doug. Maybe Glenn can. How you doing, Glenn? You know. Do you know the combination for the lock on the gate outside? Why? Oh, you know. I thought I'd go stretch my legs. You're probably better off breaking it if you have to. Oh. Oh. Good thing I got an axe. Try to get some rest. <laughs> yeah, right. I have an axe. I could do that shit. I want the newspaper. Duck, we're going outside again, sir. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yeah, I do. Let's have a look around. Okay. Okay. Right, Doug. Open sesame. That won't work. No! I was um, kidding. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doug. Okay, let's try this. Gonna break it. Awesome. Now to distract those things. Carefully. Careful. I can't reach that brick. To the brick, dude. I'm gonna throw in, I can do this. They're like, oh, oh, all your friends? Scraps, what's on TV today? We're static, I love static. No, it's not so. Are they fucking humping it? Humping the wall? Move, Kenny. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will ya? Dude, aren't you meant to run? You gotta kill, kill... He's your brother, isn't he? Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah. I'm gonna 
assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry I wasn't here. But knowing you are to take care of what I Fuck, this is brother like. Go keep doing it. Quick, get the head off. It's not enough. Lee, you gotta keep doing it. That might be enough. There we go. Holy crap! Run! You? Are you sure it's something? Like after I fucking ran an axe through its head. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Oh, Let's get in there. Oh, I, I am indeed. You don't know just how amazing yet, girl. Alright, let's do this. Stop the flirting, lady. Let's go get to business. Go ahead. Let's go, let's go get some bills. Oh no. Shit. We gotta hurry. I just kinda broke in. Oh no. Oh god. Where's my alarm clock? God dang it. It's like when you get out of bed and you're looking for your alarm. And it's your phone, and it's under your bed for some reason. Oh fuck, where is it? It's making all kinds of noise. Uh... Doc, come on, baby, time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up right back! Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Back to the back Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. <laughs> Dude, stop hitting on me! Shut up, Doug. Doug, if we don't make it through this, you should know. <laughs> I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. <laughs> no, shit. Are you sure? Shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, then. Come in, Doug. Can you look for something to stick in between the hands? Something real strong, okay? Okay. <laughs> No one lumpies is in my house. Gonna get my cane a bit, my, my daddy cane. I found something. Put the Do it.
Fuck you, Doug. Didn't call it. Ass nose, fucking dick. That's some terrible hair right there. Okay, guys. Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. And then he finds the group from the TV show. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. If you guys have enjoyed this part, leave a like. Take the annotation above my head to go to the next part. I've also got annotations down the bottom now if you want to click them. Thanks for watching, everyone. Whoop! What was that?